Happy Resurrection Day to you. This is a day we celebrate the resurrection of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Praise be to God who causes us to triumph through Christ Jesus. We have come to understand that God raised Jesus up from the dead. He says he quickened him by his spirit. He raised him up by the spirit. The same spirit that raised Christ up has raised us up from the dead. Amen. We have passed from what? From death to life in Christ Jesus. Amen. So it is a privilege as a child of God to be able to celebrate this. Amen. Because at the cross, we come to understand through the knowledge of Christ that Jesus said it was finished. He conquered our sin debt. He took care of that for me and you before we were born, that we can understand the life that has been given to us at this resurrection. The resurrection is meaning Christ in you, your hope of glory. He is our hope for what he has accomplished at the cross, that we can walk in this newness of life, newness of life. The Bible says we are new creatures. <laughs> we are something that never existed before, amen, in the sight of God. See, because this is proof, him being raised from the dead, that you and I have been totally forgiven. This is proof that we've been made right in his sight. We've been redeemed. We've been sanctified. We've been made holy. The resurrection is proof because if Jesus had not conquered sin, he wouldn't have got up. God wouldn't have raised him up. If he had not been the perfect lamb, God would not have raised him up. But God has raised him up from the dead so you and I can be raised up from the dead. This is a spiritual matter. The resurrection is a spiritual matter. See, because they thought it was over. The Romans and the, the teachers of the law and the high priests, they crucified him and put him away, had him buried because they didn't want this resurrection to be talked about. They thought it was a myth or they was hiding it from the rest of those who might believe. But you can't hide what God has done. He is the author and the finisher of our faith. So Paul says, would it be the pity of all people if Jesus had not risen from the dead? Our faith is because we are alive. God sent his son to give us life. And in that life, we can have a fellowship with God. Saints of God, let's continue to celebrate it. Because listen, it is because we've been born again. We are witnesses of this resurrection. Christ lives in us. Amen. God bless you. Celebrate it. Celebrate it. Celebrate it. Because it is, he is worthy of our praise. Amen. This is what we do in remembrance of him. Even when we are taking the communion, the Lord's Supper, we are remembering that sin and death has been conquered and God has made us right through the raising of his son who he had made alive. Amen. God bless you. We love you.